I could actually go outside and do something is it's been work, 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 and it's so hot. Like I physically cannot go outside. I'm, I'm glistening. But today I wanted to do something like I wanted to go on like a little date, okay? And I thought it might be nice to go to an aquarium because that will like at least seeing fish and like the ocean will cool you down a bit. So we're going to go to Hakajima Aquarium, or it's like a theme park. I'm not quite sure what it is. But all I know is, is that one of my students works there and she gave me some discount tickets. So I don't know, we're gonna go we're gonna go there as it was there. This is some Inaka train line. I've never rode the seaside line before, so this should be fun. This is cute! Look at that! I think this is a monorail. Yeah, I think this is a little monorail. This is super cute. This is actually quite sick. Oh, there's a train coming. Let's wait. Oh, no, they're not gonna see that. Bobby, you having a good time? <laughs> we are here. It looks like the aquarium is here, yeah. I was worried that I read the kanji wrong. So this is Sea Paradise. We have to go over this bridge to get into the island. You can hear like all the cicadas and bugs going nuts. It's wild. This this place is pretty big. There's a big carousel. We're not even in, in the area yet. This place is huge. If it wasn't hot as balls, I would do this. Okay, this is actually sick though. I really want a plushie. Maybe I should come here after I see the fish. But I really want like a jellyfish plush or something. Mm. Very so tenshi. Oh, sunfish! That's, I've never seen a sunfish plushie before, that's sick. Okay, I'm definitely getting something from here later. This place is pretty cool. What you find? Oh my god, he's cute! And you can eat him! And there's a little pudding. He can wear like a little hat, that's cute. Oh my god, you can get like a little bracelet. <gasps> oh, that's sick. I want this. I want it. There's more as well. <laughs> These are great. I might, I might actually buy one. I'm so ready to see the fish now. They're gonna think I'm one of them. There is this little cafe and it does like animal themed parfaits. Look at that! That's sick! Oh my god, the penguin crepe. Look at my crepe. I'm obsessed. I think the top part is just whipped cream. You look so angry! <laughs> this is pretty good. They have the singular best mascot I've ever seen. This giant walrus wearing a Hawaiian shirt. This place is huge. Like, I guess because I'm always in Tokyo, but it's so weird being around like such an open space. Okay, this place is huge. Oh my god. Oh, there's like seals and stuff. <laughs> they eat quite a lot. I guess that's why they're so chubby. If I get reincarnated, this, this is how I want to come back. You made a friend. He's like the same size as you. Do you think you could beat him in a fight? <gasps> he pooped. Do you see that? 
sick. <gasps> he did it twice, three times, damn. So it turns out that walruses are actually disgusting. He is huge. I think I, I had this guy in Animal Crossing. <gasps> Whoa. Okay, this might be my favorite. These are, these are disgusting. I love them. I wore these sparkly um, leg warmers because I thought they would attract the fish. Who's your favorite? Mm, I like Kiros. He's very yellow. Celery. Celery. <laughs> ABC. He's cute, yeah. I like this, it's like a host club. <laughs> and this lights up and also there's a giant shark this guy is huge this is the best picture I will ever take it's this guy okay, so you can touch them you can touch them but you can't grab them It feels harder than I imagine. <laughs> this guy, I don't want to touch this guy. Yeah, that's dumb. Look at that guy. Look at his little, his little glowing whisker. Why am I so stupid? And I'm coming here just to make fun of all the ugly fish. I'm playing a game called which of these fish I would eat. I would eat all of these fish and I would especially eat these like eels, they look delicious. They would probably taste like unagi. Um, yeah, I think I, I would probably eat all of these. Apart from that white thing, I probably wouldn't eat that. Robin, would you eat these fish? No. None of them? No. You would. If I serve that long one to you with like the unagi sauce, you would eat it. I'm telling you. Yeah, it's like very tasty. They don't like tasting now, but that's because he's not scared. We came just as it finished, but this would have been sick. This whole park really reminds me of uh, my mom lived in Spain in Alicante, and she lived in like one of those weird pockets of like you know the British people and the German people, and they all live in like one kind of like community. But it still looks a little bit Spanish, and there's loads of shopping malls. It really reminds me of there. Right, let's go to Dolphin Fantasy. That sounds fun. Dolphins are actually like assholes in the wild. You can get really close to the dolphins. This is really cool. Dolphins have sex with each other in the blowhole. In the blowhole. Okay, the dolphin fantasy. I will be your guy. Ticket. We got like this a ticket just for aquarium. So with the aquarium ticket, I'm not sure if we can ride this, but this looks really cool. Okay, this Chinese restaurant right here. So 
So recently I'm watching this show on Netflix called The Boyfriend. It's a reality gay dating TV show. It is amazing, please watch it. But they ate at that restaurant on one of the dates. They came here to Hakajima Sea Paradise for, I guess sometimes they let them win dates and they came here on their date and they ate there. I wasn't sure if it was this place exactly because I didn't mention it, but then when I saw that I knew that that was the place they came on their date. So I'm really, really happy. <laughs> We're gonna hit this buffet blaze. I haven't had a buffet in such a long time. I thought it might be able to be fun. This is nice. Hello. I got one of everything. Right now it's like an Asian fair and they're doing this gorgeous coconut Nepalese chicken curry. Looks real good. The view's really pretty too. I'm gonna do it boys. Hakajima <laughs> actually ended up being way cooler than I thought it would be. I've been to a lot of these parks, like a lot of them opened during the bubble era in Japan in like the 80s. So there's a lot of these kind of like really big ambitious looking theme parks that they kind of abandoned. I thought it was going to be like that but there's a lot of restaurants and a lot of stuff to do here. I do recommend coming. I think it's like two hours from Tokyo but I think it's really worth actually traveling that far to come here. Particularly like the longer I'm in Japan, like the less time I do actually like spending in Tokyo because it is so crowded and I really don't like the crowds and the lines. So coming out today was great. Honestly, you go on any of the rides, there wasn't a line. Um, it's super open and spacious, just really, really nice. So yeah, anyways, as usual, thank you for watching and please subscribe. Bye.